Hello, my crafty friends. This is Christy over at Crafty Christy's Creations, and today I have another Silhouette Studio tutorial for you, and we are going to be working on tiling. Uh, this is an option that is only available in Business Edition, but this feature lets you make larger than your standard 12 by 12 projects. So let me show you what I'm talking about. Alrighty, so here is my design. I have this mandala that I made in Procreate and I went ahead and traced it so it's now cuttable. And then I added some text here and I gave it a bit of a line, uh, line color, um, increased my point on my line to make this a thicker font. And then I went ahead and grouped everything together. So if I take this, and you can see right now, it's 48 inches wide. So I'm going to be putting this above my king size bed, and I'm going to make it out of temporary vinyl. So it won't ruin the paint, and I can take it down at any time. So now if I go to my sun panel with everything as is, uh, well, first of all, I don't have it on my, uh, on my mat, and it's not going to fit. Uh, so I could easily come in here manually and do all the work and put in a grid and see how that's going to look. But business edition already does all of that for you. So if you come down over here to our media layout setup panel, we can click on that. And then and you can see a lot of things are grayed out. It doesn't really want you to do anything until you open up this split screen. Do you find this helpful? Make sure you smash that like button and hit subscribe so you don't miss out on any future Silhouette Studio tutorials. Now let's jump back in where we left off. And then it's got my media, which is my materials set at 12 by 12. Um, I've got mine in a roll so I can easily cut it 12 by 12. But if I needed to, I could come in here and say, okay, I'm only cutting on... Um, regular printer size, eight and a half by 11. So then you can see what that does is it'll end up giving us, now we've got 18 of these cuts instead of 12. So you can change that up based on what your material looks like. But my material is the standard 12 by 12. I can cut it like that. So now that gives me 12 different mats that I can cut. And uh, you can see here, they've got it pulled out. This it looks really fuzzy right here, but that's the text. Once you zoom in, you'll notice it looks just fine. Okay, so this first tab is so that you can uh, go ahead and make any adjustments to where you need it to cut. And then this next one here is if you wanted to kind of more do it yourself, you could limit things. Uh, if you wanted to nest it onto the mat, we're already doing that. And really what we're doing is the tiling. And then we're doing it relative to the job. Um, I'm going to configure it automatically, meaning I am letting the machine do the work. I don't have any margin on there. And then down here I can select uh, either all the tiles and it will send them to the send panel one at a time like this. Or I can just select and show just one at a time. So let's go ahead and look at panel 10. So and here's your close-up of what it looks like. Let me move this out of the way. And you can see it's highlighted it over here to tell me this is what it's cutting. So here is the end of the S. Here's the kiss, the beginning of the M. And then this is the bottom of the design. But you'll also notice that it's added these little lines on the side, which means it's going to cut those as well. And that way um, you've got a nice straight flat line to go ahead and connect that to the rest of your pieces. So that way they're all um, smoothly connected with these lines here. All right. So now if I do just this one and now if I go over to my send panel, you can see it's only going to send this one piece and I've got it on cut and I've got I'm going to use just my uh, red regular Oracle um, vinyl. And then I can go ahead and send it and it will cut this page from here. I could go back to my design, choose uh, a different one. If I just wanted to do them one at a time, or I can choose all of my tiles. And now if I come to my send panel, 
it's going to go ahead and do this one and then this one and then this one. It'll kind of do them all in order. So once one's cut, you'll go ahead and reload your mat and put in the next one. So this is how you can use the tiling feature in Business Edition of Silhouette Studio to make yourself larger than your 12 by 12 or 12 by 24 uh, area uh, design and get it cut up and put together.